great love. God's great love. The reason why I'm putting on their great because great is something out of the ordinary. Great is similar to something miraculous. Miraculous is something out of the ordinary. Miraculous is taken from the word close to Maria, miracle. Miraculous, a miracle. Amen. When a thing is miraculously done, you think about that nobody can do that for God. Amen. Amen. Right on up, up, and it get above the stone. Amen. 
Amen. And when that flame get above the stone, it's way up there where there's no rain, no thunder, no lightning. Nice. And you're looking down at the clouds. Nice. And the sun is up there that's shining so bright. Amen. And down here where the rest of the folks are, they're in a mess. Amen. And I'm going to tell you, to ride in the plane high and looking down on the earth, look at the whole earth look like a mess. Amen. Look so nasty down here. Amen. Everything looks filthy. Amen. Amen. But God came in the world to clean up the filth. Amen. God's great love. Amen. And every time that song is sang, that Sister Griffin sang last night, it does something to me. Amen. They sing that song that he looked beyond my folks and so I need God. God's grace is with us today. Amen. Do y'all not know that? Amen. God's grace, God's mercy. If God was to draw his grace from us and grow and draw his mercy from you and send out his judgment. Amen. All of us are dry. Because we ain't fit to be judged. We ain't yet ready to come before the judgment. Amen. So God let us live. Yes. Amen. You wake when you awaken this morning, his love touch you. God's love. You know, love go a long way with us. When you love an individual, you make them feel like they are somebody. Love is not just saying I love you. Love is not just in words alone. A portion of it is in words, but it's not just all in words. Because some people can, they, they know how to place words. They study for that. Some folks study words. They study human beings. A lot of we preachers do that. Amen. Amen. Yeah. That's why I don't do too much about raising money anymore. Because the, the, the mass of folks accuse me of knowing how to get the money from the people. Well, that is one of my gifts. So I try to impart it with my brothers, my gift. And I sit down, as you notice, and I don't say anything about the money. I, I put enough out here and let you see the lights are on, and they just, they, the lights from Cornell so just don't stay on. Right. And these flows that you see just don't stay like that all the time. You've got to be self-dumped to those flows. Right? And anybody have any knowledge of understanding when when women come in, you don't just come in here and find the heat without it being paid for. Amen. Amen. If you think about it, somebody loved the church enough. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Uh, 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 yes, sir. Yes, yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. To see to it that when you come in, that you are comfortable. Yeah. Are you listening? Yeah. And when you see that these things are. Uh, uh, taking place and when the brother get up and say, well, you know, Con Ellison got to be paid. That wasn't me saying that. But he, he understood that. I didn't say that so much and Deacon Parker didn't say it so much. And Deacon Parker didn't have to be up there. Right? Yeah. Brother Rick is one of the, among the youngest, the youngest men in the church. He one among the last brothers come in. Right. And we turn over the young man. Yeah. Right. So you get up and talk some. Tell them that you love the church. Love! Move out! Praise God. Love make you do something for somebody else besides yourself. If you look on your own self, 
you will never do nothing. Praise God. Praise God, everybody. Amen. If you look on yourself, you will never do nothing financially for nobody. Jesus, hallelujah. But you. Because the way you would see it, I don't have no more than enough. enough. I don't even have enough for myself. Well, if you look at that way. Right. And the rich man don't even know how he lives. Amen. Bless the Lord. Bless the Lord. I said, pity y'all. I said, wouldn't want to be in none of y'all shit. Amen. Amen. I don't know if y'all watch debates, but I watch all of the debates with the president. Yes. One them, one them black ladies direct her question right direct to President Bush. She said, Mr. Bush, I'm going to ask you a question. So how can you relate to be poor people when you don't know anything about being poor? How can you relate to a working person when you ain't never lost a job? Yeah. 
God, how great folks are. Ain't nobody great but God. Yeah. Whatever going on about you, it's God having it going on. Yeah. Whether you've done wrong or right, it's God that permitted you. That was one of God's permission will. Yeah. You told a lie, God permit you to open your mouth and close it. Yeah. Yeah. You ain't saying much back to me. Yeah. Church, they claim. Be. 
and kept back part of the price. After they sold it, they kept back part. That was too much for them to give. Uh -huh. Let people look at the tithes. After God done blessed them a whole week to draw a big check, they said five hundred dollars this week. Uh -huh. All right, they supposed to pay fifty dollars. Uh -huh. Right? Uh -huh. All right. Oh my, fifty dollars is too much out of five hundred. My, you got four hundred and fifty. So why are you looking at fifty? Well, yes, yeah. sir. Well, when you got four hundred and fifty, yeah. a narrow-minded thing. Yeah. Got four hundred and fifty dollars, and look at it. This is too much for the church. Yeah. When they sold the land. They didn't know it was coming but to so much. Right. When God began to bless you, you had never been blessed so much till you got in the church. Right. Until you start serving God, your eyes didn't come open. Right. 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 You were doing good, but you did better after you got in church. Right. And stop cutting the food. Yeah. Read. His wife also being private to it. His wife also would know about it. They'll yeah. read. Uh -huh. And brought a certain part. They brought a certain part. And laid it at the, the apostles' feet. And seat. brought it to and gave it to the preacher. The folks they would preach out, preacher getting all the money. Preacher getting all the money. All the money the preachers get. I ain't going to that church and give that man all of my money.
this, I go down on to, they don't think I done committed adultery. Now you may be done committed one. Well, yeah. 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 Why did you get that in your mind? Well, yes, sir. Yeah. 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 They don't think so. Who cares what they think? As long as your heart is right. Everybody. Everybody. So, it's it. Any nice, you and your wife could have changed your mind. Huh? After y'all sold the land. Yeah. But the devil is talking. Uh, Are y'all listening? Yeah. If you love the Lord and you love the church, you would let the devil talk to your mind. Yeah. 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 Amen. Yeah. If you love the cause of Christ, you would, you would push the devil out of your mind. Yeah. Yeah. God loves me, so why should I talk against God's program? Yeah. Yeah. That ain't the thing that 
you need. Amen. You and I need a spiritual picture. You made one mistake that you weren't even thinking about. Amen. Do you not know the devil brought our minds? Amen. He'll yeah. block out everything that's good and bring in a negative thing. Yeah. Yeah. What is the negative thing? Self. Yeah. Me and myself and I. Yes, sir. Yeah. Say, any nice. You didn't lie to us. You didn't lie to the church. Yeah. But the man that you was trying to hide from, yeah. hallelujah, look at this. Yeah. Hallelujah. The man that you was trying to cover up from, you and your wife were looking right straight at y'all, making up your mind. Yeah. Yeah. To who that? So that was the Holy Ghost and the night. So the Holy Ghost was right there looking at y'all, you and your husband, and y'all were making up your mind. The Holy Ghost heard everything y'all see. Yeah. Amen. Yeah. Amen. 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 Read such what? Thou hast not lied unto men. You didn't lie to God. man. You didn't lie to man, but you lied to God. You didn't resist man. You resist God. Yeah. Now you want power with God. Yeah. Now you want authority with God when you don't rebel against God's program. Yeah. When you don't rebel against God's ideas and God's thoughts. Now you want God to revive you. Yeah. God can't help you when you don't talk against God. Yeah. Yeah. What happened to Ananias? Something out of you and I. Amen. That 
foolishness. But God's alive. But God died. He went and suffered. He gave his only son, only begotten son, and put him in this world and let you read about how they treat him. God's son. You ain't got a child that allows somebody to treat them. Let God allow them to treat his son. Amen. Amen. They don't need to talk about your Holy Ghost. Amen. And you're coming to church. Amen. Nobody better not be act like they've been treating your child and you there looking. Amen. And mine too. I ain't talking about you, but I talk about myself. Amen. I'm here today to defend my child. And if you want to get next to me, then you mistreat my baby. Uh, yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, my children. I might give you a little chance on my wife. <laughs> yes, sir. Good boy, So y'all can't see me with her. <laughs> Why am I saying that? It's because Sister Wiley can really talk if she wants to. If I don't talk, I can listen. <laughs> I thought you would talk for me, but yeah, since you ain't gonna talk, yeah, God ain't getting nothing in my mouth. Yeah, yeah, huh? Yeah. And I don't speak up. Yeah. I thought I had a husband yeah, to look out for me. Yeah, but if he don't, I will. And you can't blame them. Yes. Amen. But when you look at your children, it's helpless. Yes. Yes. Amen. And can't fight for themselves. Amen. It moves you rapidly. Yes. Faster. Yes. When God so loves you. Yes. 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 Yes.
them. But you can pray that to everybody. That said, thank you, Jesus. That's a prayer in itself. When you thank God for waking you this morning, that's a prayer in itself. You got to say thank you, Jesus.